if I am closer to the Lord, his right hand will uphold me. Are you interested? Lift up your right hand. Father, I thank you for your word this morning. I know that the grass withers and the flower fades, but your word is eternal. Send your word. Use me. Speak through me. Give me the anointing that makes teaching easy. Give me unction to function. Anoint the ears of the hearers. Let them hear the word of God. Let them not hear men, but let them hear the oracles of God. We'll have your way this morning. Holy Spirit, you are welcome. Even as I'm speaking this word, draw your people closer to you as you desire, Lord, in Jesus' name. Somebody say amen. Praise the name of the Lord. You may be seated. We know that the grass withers and the flower fades, but your word is eternal. Breaking the chains, unlocking your destiny. I remember when Peter had denied Jesus three times. And, you know, during the time that Jesus was, was carrying the cross and they were beating him and all, that, and all those kind of things, um, if you read your Bible carefully, you will realize that Peter had not run away from Jesus. He was still following. But the Bible says he was following afar off. He was following afar off. So, so it is possible to follow the Lord, but follow him from afar off. And in the scripture we read there, he says, my soul follows close behind you. Close behind you. So, so, so your following God must be a close following. A close following. If you want to see God's hand upon your life, you must follow God close. Close. It's easy to speak to somebody who's close to you. Why does God have to shout instructions to you? It's because you are too far. You are too far. When you are close, when you are far, you, 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 when you are far from somebody, like somebody maybe who's at the back there, you can't smell my perfume right now. But when you are close, you, 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 you smell the essence of the perfume. Are you understanding me? Because you are close. I, I, can, 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 can you experience God or are you just a church goer? So many follow but are far off. They are still a Christian. They can still claim to be a child of God, but they are far. How close are you to God? And the Lord asked me a piercing question. He said to me, he said, are you closer to people than you are to me? And, 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 and this is a question that you should, you should really ask yourself today. Are you closer to God or people? And the answer is people. The answer is people. And, 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 and the Lord said to me, you know, he says, you know, I, I, so he says marriage is an, in, is an institution that I began in the Garden of Eden. I said, yes, Lord. He says, I love the fact that people get married. He who finds a wife, finds a good thing and obtains favor in the eyes of the Lord. I said, yes, Lord. It says, it's not good for men to be alone. I said, yes, Lord. He says, but, but, but unfortunately, many have married themselves away from me. Because the moment that many people, even never mind marriage, just a boyfriend can change your commitment to God. Can change your commitment to God. I'm not saying you shouldn't have a boyfriend. I know you have one whether I say what I'm saying or not. It's fine. Carry on. But, but, but when, 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 when that boyfriend takes the place of God, you are now fighting with God. You are now fighting with God. For some years, you know, I didn't like those years, but, but, but I had to go through it. For some years, God told me to shut down business and focus on ministry. Oh, I hated that time. Because me, I don't like waiting for people to give me money. Ah, I want my own money. I hated it. And the Lord said to me, he said, I, I, he said, I, I gave you that instruction so that your focus 
for that period of time would be 100% on me because I wanted to draw you closer and I couldn't do it while you were focused on business. Because proper business requires your focus. You, 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 you can't be, be, listen, you can't chase two things at the same time. This, this pulpit is too far. Bring it closer. <laughs> I, I hope somebody will understand what I'm teaching today. If you catch this, you become a giant. You become a giant in the kingdom. Place it, place it right here. Right here. You become a giant in the kingdom. Say, I'm ready to become a giant in the kingdom. I said to the Lord, Lord, why is it that Christians look ineffective not look. Christians are ineffective. They are ineffective. And he said, because they say they follow me, but they are far. He says, follow me. He says, follow me closely. Now, 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 now you must ask your question. Are you following close? Or are you far off? Do you know when you are far from God, you know it. You, you don't need anyone to come and say, Oh, Jazoma is here and Omaya. Wakuri Namari. If you can skip Sunday service here and there, you are far from God. If you can go a whole day without saying Holy Spirit, you are far from God. The whole day you have not prayed. How far are you from God? If you, if you follow after other people, you will water down your commitment to God. And I learned this of the Lord, that, that God doesn't leave, doesn't leave you just one day. He leaves you slowly. Like, 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 I don't, <laughs> I don't go, Pera. And you can be deceived for a while and keep going. But there's a time when you now know, Kuti, Mweam Tenabasin. And so, you see, you, 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 you don't just. Start by just being at the back. No, you, 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 you sort of, you sort of drift away. It's like it's backsliding. I used back jumping, backsliding. You say, slide back. Bijana, bijana. Bijana, bijana. From the things of God. You know, you used to pray three times a day. Now, you, you know, now you've come to two. Eventually, you justify one. And then, you know, you know, eventually you, you're not even praying. You, you, you're looking for somebody to pray for you. And now Paul, follow me in the same way that I follow Christ. So don't follow a man of God who's not following Christ. I didn't say don't follow a man of God who's not perfect. I'm not, neither are you. In fact, I'm more perfect than you. Truth be told. Otherwise, we'd be on the other side of this equation. So, the issue is, you are following, yes. You are in church, yes. Praise God. But how closely are you following this God? So, the, the, you see, uh, there are things you do to get closer to God. I will share those things with you. Otherwise, this sermon is useless. There are things you, you, you actively do. You know, I, I corrected somebody. They said, you know, the Lord speaks to whoever they want, he wants to speak to. I, it's not like that. It's not like that. If I want God to talk to me, there are things I can do. It's not by chance. It's not like, 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 where it's like just by chance or by force. No, there, there are things that I can do to, to activate 
the voice of God in my life. There are things I can do to activate the hand of God in my life. There are things I can do to activate the presence of God. I, 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 I don't know if somebody's getting what I'm saying. I said, I said, no, there are actually things you can actually do to activate the things of God. It's, it's like saying, you know, God will just bless whoever he wants to bless. And, 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 and you know, sometimes if, if people can even justify that and say, with scripture and say the rain falls on the just and the unjust. But you've just taken one scripture, Nebadumbu. There are things I can do to activate financial blessings in my life. You don't just prosper by chance. There are things that you can do. So let's not take this thing as though, you know, you know, God just does what he wants and, you know, some are fortunate to get it, some are not fortunate. No, no, there are principles in the Bible. So why are you far from the Lord? Why are you far from the Lord? And the Lord said, some people, they marry away from me. He said, some people, the moment they have children, the child takes the place of God. See, proof of passion is in pursuit. You will never pursue anything you're not passionate about. How passionate are you about God? Do you look for excuses not to come to church? Good reasons. Ah, at least I'm going to church. Is, is, is God that, that not important in your life, for lack of better grammar? Is it so not important in your life that, that, that you, you see no reason to put him first? Now, how do we know you don't put him first? He's not priority, number one. Number two, you don't seek him early. Because first thing is, first. First thing is first. Do you put God first? Do you put God first? And the answer is a big fat no. God is just an entity you need to further your agenda as far as you are concerned. And you see, the thing I've learned about God is God wants a relationship, not a using arrangement. Now, I wish somebody would write that down. God wants a what? A relationship. He doesn't want to be used. You think God doesn't know if he's being used? God is not your mob that you only engage when there's a mess. That's not, you don't have a relationship with your mob. Do, do, do you have a relationship with You don't have a relationship with your mob. You just mop and you just put it on the side. You, sometimes you don't even clean it. You clean it the next time you want to clean again. So, oh, by the way, that's, that's, that's how people want to use God. So God is just an entity you use to further your agenda. And it's your agenda because you don't ask him what is your will. You just use him. God, I need money. Where are you? And if he doesn't provide according to your timetable, you're offended. We begin to question. Now, we begin to question the authenticity of God. And yet the authenticity that is in question is not God's authenticity. It is your... Uh, the commitment in question is not God's commitment towards you. It's your commitment towards God. He says, seek me early. You don't seek him early. You don't. What is the first thing you do in the morning? Who is the first person you talk to in the morning? I learned this from Benny Hinn, very powerful. Good morning, Holy Spirit. Ah, anybody who's ever read that book, powerful book. He said, the first thing you should say every morning is, good morning, Holy But because Holy Spirit, I got around you, baby. Yeah, na baby. Ma bisa, yeah. Never mind. Manya, 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 you're still young. Run, 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 run. You're still very young. Brian, please stand up. Tavazo, please stand up. So, look at this example. 
Look at this example. Right. Because you are later on. Please hold your husband's hand. So, you see, in fact, in fact sorry, sorry, my apologies. Just release the hand. I'll, I'll work with Tafaz. Come, come forward. Tafaz, lift up your hands. Tafaz would pray. This one, And one of her prayer points, Aruna Madanditi, out to marry, do thou baby. Wang. This one. God answers and gives her baby work. And the baby work brand. Right. He gives a brand. This one, we need baby number one. This one. So God now, who you are now talking to, you now share the time. <laughs> you had a lot of time for him. They don't like it. It's okay. Right. We in the bay number one. Then this one is born. Hello? So now, Zato West, can it have a much more than 30 minutes? I compare 10 minutes. And he's saying, but what am I supposed to do with these responsibilities? I must look after bay number one, and I must look after baby. So as a result now, we, we, we feel comfortable to take away time from God because he doesn't complain. So now, it's like, we need pay number two, yeah, listen. this one. all right. Number three, <laughs> it is business it. This is your bag, yeah? It is business it. So God gives you a business. What I mean? One pay number. So, can I watch you for 10 minutes? 10 minutes, that's what I say. So God is now saying, all right, okay, okay. You prayed for the husband I gave you. This husband. You prayed for the fruit of the womb and I gave you. You prayed for business and I gave you. So now God is now number four. In your life, in fact, number five, because number one is you, number two, bay one, number three, bay two, number four, business, number five, God. Actually, if we are to tell the truth, please stand up, Mama. Your mother <laughs> comes before God. So after you've dealt with your husband, you've dealt with your child, you've balanced your business books, you've settled things with your mom, then maybe God. Tatenda, <laughs> come. Titi, titi, come. Come. And, 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 and you see, position yang wari ramba is slide. Because <laughs> So my priorities Amrora. Hello? They are now more important than God. So so God used to be number one. Then he became number two. Then he became number three. Abba number one. Number six, I said up here. I said up here. Pana and one of church, we are not on. Depend on one of church. Yeah, we are. God bless you. Come. Come. So, 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 so now, you know, and, and, and God is happy about your progress. You are now being established. Since I was looking fire. Yeah, now, all right. Now, 
kana mzukuru ele mzuna apa ingo yakuna mata mwe ngo mocho putupi majupi jupi my pepi apa ingo ya white lo shabaka tibaya mwari jehova muri kupi kwa baba nguva hiyo yatorwa na kupuzu puzu jipu kuzu putu majupi kuzu jipu 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 wautana dzwe ndimi lititipu kuzu jipu kutubu my pupu my pepi Tora mzukuru mai mabiza tora mzukuru tora mzukuru tora mzukuru eh tora mzukuru eh mambova kubasa kama isa kubasa kusaid mambo tora mzukuru kupishu vokozi pe eh yasa baba tora mzukuru baba tora mzukuru ah tafazo wajio futi nae eh I I are you seeing the picture are you seeing the picture so God is saying in your life what number am I He is saying I don't have your heart anymore. Your heart is now in these people and these things. Or I did a business it. Abona madaft Jehovah increase my territory, enlarge my territory. Kwa rimwe business. Now imagine with me rimwe big up. Kwa rimwe big up. Kwa rimwe big up. Wa garo rumdege. Dubai South Africa business meeting America Thailand Chama da Opras Ko ku church atikuona mazwano ndiri busy Apa ngwari apa ngwari ndi uika handizi A number one Now tikakuvhudza kuti unoda ngwari here what is your answer Eh ngwari ndire say ndino muda Is it priority Yeah of course God is priority but is he really priority or is he just someone that you talk to after you have finished with life and he's saying this the, the bible talks about him spitting you out because he's no longer your first love so what needs to happen is 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 yeah mzorenyi god bless you God bless you. Is you need to learn to handle these responsibilities. Kana kana yango yakunamata mwana ano mzukuru anotorwa opwao kuna somebody who can attend to the child. Autambe ne mzukuru nguva yanwari. Oh takangana zvimwe ka zvimwe zvino I think this one actually ka is actually even more powerful than all of these TV yeah. TV oh cherongo cherongo raka kuti please you are telling out god mbomirai yeah tambona tambona bora oh uefa champions league Azite azite tuna matengo ya Champions League as if those players they know you they don't even know you they don't want to know you cheroka ni avazizive avasi kuzvinzwa avana basa nazo yet you are prioritizing things and people that matter less than god e time guy call off the cell phone to now to the end that can I walk na mata walk na mata uripa whatsapp you have now mastered doing tongues and typing at the same time lo kama soda le re 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 bozo ndomo ko liba haya la jama zo kala ba zata maji kala ba haya za bo kali ndere boza tiba ja kala ra Liko sota majo kala raba zo kali rada rama haya. So God is saying, what kind of relationship do I have with you that I come after all of this? And now get just get into trouble. You want to use God like an extinguisher. Fire extinguisher. For many people God is a fire extinguisher. The moment they have a problem 
God, where are you? And God just, God prioritizes you on the level that you prioritize him. God bless you. You know you, know you can go home right now. What? What all right? What all right? So, my job as the pastor now is, please, God, is that you manifest? God, now, Matei. Some of you now, you know, Chero, Pelagat, lift up your hands. There, there are mothers now who sit in church during praise and worship, holding babies. So, kwa hara kato wana authentic excuse why you should not lift up your hands to heaven because waka bata mwana. Of, ansu kutu mwana haane sen. Asu mwana ano tenu. Mwana ano tenu. How far are you from God? Uh, I want to watch this. We are satisfied with a form of godliness. But denying the what? The power thereof. Why? Because when we say we are worshipping, we're not really worshipping. We're looking around church, we're seeing, oh, I don't want to pastor. I have 10 past nine. We worship you, oh Lord. You are... Nay, Jeanette, I forgot to name my dose, dose, dose. I got to take three weeks ago. We are worthy to be prayed. Oh, you for me, Masha. We give you all the glory. That's what I'm going to ask you to take desk. We worship you, oh Lord. God is saying, is there any intimacy in that? When are you going to birth intimacy with God? Looking around during worship. He can't even connect to God. In fact, when somebody who spends time with God is standing next to you, they are now weeping in the presence of God. You're saying, am I having my problems? <laughs> you know, my chamber, I think they must be married to our problems. I think I'll squeeze a number of because no one has a number of people who are going to be So I think, ha, chaka chaya on Bego, chaka chaya, ha, 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 you are worthy to be praised. Ha! Wakumana, nay, Wakumana, Mkwaya. Ha! Mkwaka funya, shed mwana, the blake. Do sakamu tana mfundi skaisi. We worship you, oh Lord. You are worthy to be praised. Nasi saw Miranda, I will change last week on the sipo. We worship you, oh Lord. That's you in the, in the presence of your spiritual headmaster, the pastor. Because headmaster can have At least you are, you are supposed to try and do your best. Now, I wonder if this is how you behave in church. What about at home? When, when I say pray at home, where there's no supervision, at least I say, you are not praying. Come on, pray. Push. Come on. You are going to pray and do further notice. Lift up your hands. Is it? Can I show you money? Because soon I'm going to move home. Go to Nawa Kumba. So, 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 this says to you, to Utam. And because to Utam, Baga, it won't produce results. My unbeliever, I'm going to go to Rama Tenda, but it's smoke. Uchita stress. Ope zatu kukumwaru wacho. Kukumwaru wacho. Where is your commitment? You are following, but are far off. Proverbs 8. 
Dukuze ngwe deception neta wano mchechi. Aini mwara no ndi daini. Aini mwara no ndi daini. God's love is unconditional. He loves me no matter what. You don't read your Bible. You don't read your Bible. You see, love your daughter, you love your povo. Mwara ne love your povo. Haji. I know your general love. For God so loved the world. World. He was always world. <laughs> that he gave Jesus for everyone, for all body. Yes, he gave Jesus for all body. That one, general. Kupovo. But there's a specific love. Give me verse 17, I think it is. A specific love. Look at this. I love those who love me. Already part of the difference, Kudara. I love those who do what? Love. Who love me. And now he tells us which ones. Not, not look at me, look at me. Not, not, I love you, Lord. I love Lord. He tells us which ones are the lovers of God. And those who seek me. Not annually, but Easter. Diligently. What shall happen to them? They will find me. So, listen, listen to this gift. In other words, what he's saying is, if you seek me but not diligently, when you need me, you won't find me. Power yeah. desperate paper because I want a diligence in seeking me. Because we don't talk. Because that is your attitude. When you seek me, I'll play hide and seek with you. I'm shy. Simply because so, so, so now, when, when you are at your point of desperation, you don't see God because you are not diligent. You are seeking God on your own terms. Serving God on your own terms. As you stand, my job as a teacher is to correct you. As you stand, seeking God on your own terms does not work. Because the true power of Christianity is in your relationship with God. I'm telling you the truth. If you catch that, you've caught it. The true power of your work with God is in your relationship with God. And anything, you know, about relationship, yo, yo, such an, I know to make a show out. Hallelujah. So, 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 so it's not just about seeking. It's about seeking diligently. God wants you to seek after him frequently. He, so he checks frequency. Frequency. No, God wants you to set time apart for him. Set time apart for him. You see, if someone or something is important, you will give it time. Hello? Hello? You give it time. And God is important. Why does he not have your time? You say, I have no time for God. I have no time for God. You better adjust your schedule to fit your God. Adjust that schedule. Discipline on Do you know sometimes even a child that you, you don't train well, the moment you wake up at midnight to pray, do to move you away from God. Because the devil knows Kutiso. If you correct this 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 morning, if you correct this part. If you correct this part of seeking God and getting closer to him, he's finished. Amen. He knows. Your power is in your personal prayer. Your personal study of the word. Do you know what I teach you now? As powerful as it is, it cannot compare to your own personal meditation. Where God now begins to speak to you, the two of you. That time is very, very powerful. And the devil tries his best to move you away from that time. 
Say, I refuse. For any strategy of the devil to move me away from God's presence. You can't, write this down, you can't fulfill your destiny being far away from God. You can't. That's why it's God-given destiny. <laughs> and it was God-given destiny. So how can you fulfill a God-given destiny far away from God? And those who have got no time to spend time with God, they become prayer projects for pastors. Pastors practice their power on you. So anything you want to destroy, put it before God. Amen. <laughs> Did you get that, Clarence? Anything in your life that you want to destroy, put it before God. You know the Lord said something to me. <laughs> you know what the Lord said to me? Buddhist. And Israel, there are people who I have not given money because I still want them to look for me. Could it be that you have delayed your prosperity? Because God knows. The moment you have a business, how close are you to God? You see, when you are far, you can't hear. And the beauty about God is when you are near, you hear his whisper. He doesn't shout secrets. He whispers them. Even you, you whisper secrets. Let, let me tell you a secret. Let me tell you a secret. It's no longer a secret. What is a secret? Let me, te let me tell you a secret. Come, 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 come. So secrets are told to those who are close. And prosperity is all about secrets of success. That's why you're not succeeding. You don't know secrets. You are too far from God. So no matter how busy you are, you've got to find time to prioritize God. I hope you're getting that. Praise the name of the Lord. We know that the grass withers and the flower fades, but your word is eternal. Destiny